This video is going to highlight and showcase a day in the life of a real-time medical commodity reseller, specifically diabetic supplies. Yo, what's up guys, it's Felix from Giant Lifestyle. So in this video, I'm going to show you guys a day in the life of somebody who really flips medical commodities. I was out in Newark today looking at some properties that I'm interested in buying, and while I was out here, I knew my boy, my student, and now my business partner, Isaiah, who is actually flipping medical commodities, and I wanted to check in on him and see how he was doing. Isaiah also has a little trucking business, and from medical commodities, he was able to quit his job. We're gonna go a day in the life and show you everything he does to run this business, and we're also gonna go over the three C's, which is cash flow, credit, and collateral, and show you how he's piecing it all together to get the results he wants. Let's get into the video. All right, guys, so I'm with my boy Isaiah right here. What we're gonna do now is we're going to wire his car with a mobile camera. Because his client knows him and not me, it's best that he does the pickup. So he actually has some boxes already for the day. I wanted to capture them all, but you know, he can't really just let money be sitting around. Can you show them what you got? Absolutely. How much so, money are you looking at today as far as profit? So we got right here about like 175 in profit. I, I actually picked up four boxes of FSL, 100 count, right okay, here. that's good. And I got a box of 100 count OTU. Okay, cool, okay, so, cool. So right now, I'm gonna wire his car with the mobile camera. You're gonna see exactly what he does, meeting his client, paying his client, inspecting the product. And uh, clients like this just come back, what, month after month? Month after month, man. Okay, cool. So. You're gonna see that stage, then we're gonna do some marketing, show you his other clients, show you how to follow up so you can keep getting that residual money. Let's get into it. Absolutely, man. <laughs> so yeah, yeah. so these boxes, you know, these are uh, damaged, and um, so you got the 100 count right here, so. So definitely like a 50 count. Right? Exactly. Yeah, so, okay, so since these are, you know, these are a little messed up, you know. Yeah, so it's whatever you do. Uh, I can do $20. Oh, whatever you do. All right, perfect, man. So, so how often do you get the um the uh, one touch variable? I'm supposed to get it twice a month. Twice a month. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool, I cool. Twice a month. So there you go. Mm -hmm. So definitely appreciate it, man. So yeah, definitely give me a call back. You know when you get some more. Okay. All right, man. Appreciate it, man. You got that, baby. Thank All right, man. Take care, guys, man. Guys, nah, no, no, no doubt, man. No doubt. So I'm getting ready to um put these uh put some double-sided tape on the sign and we're gonna uh put them up. So I'm gonna show you how we do it. So we cut a little small piece there, put it on top. And then we cut another small piece. So you don't use like a stapler? Nah, nah, I just I just find it easier to use double sided tape because you know it's easier to cut and uh you know it's less of a hassle. Put another piece right there, so you got So two. these are just bandit signs basically. Yeah, these just basically bandit signs, you know, we put up. So let's see the sign, okay. So you're looking for those diabetic supplies, and then there's your number. We're not gonna show the full number just for your protection, but, so basically just yellow bandit signs. Yeah, yellow out. and black works pretty good. You know, it catches people's attention. So, so yeah, so we're gonna put these up right now, and we'll show you how that looks. <laughs> I won't take it down and yeah that's about it curious what like is your favorite part about this business like if you had to pick up like one thing about actually you know flipping these medical commodities what would you say it is so my favorite part about this business man is the, uh basically the invoicing you know just you know getting invoicing my, my private buyer getting paid yeah that's, a, that's my favorite part yeah man I, I like that part too because like i like in a business to kind of know where i'm gonna get my money from i don't like like especially with rental properties i look at real estate in a, in a fix and flip deal you don't know who's gonna buy that deal but in a rental property you know every single month on the first you're gonna get a check so i'd have to say i agree with you on that because there's nothing better than getting that you know you pick up those boxes you got today you're gonna you're gonna invoice or you're gonna wait till you got a few more boxes so i'm gonna wait so i'll get a few more boxes you know i like to invoice basically when i have at least you know 15 more boxes so that way you know that invoice looks nice you know yeah, yeah i got you
saying, especially, you know, this is, you know, uh, low, like low income area. So yeah. there'd be a lot of people, you know, here that, that you know, they can sub. All right, so briefly explain to them what happens when someone actually sees that sign and calls that number. What do you say? What do you ask them? What do you tell them? So basically, when somebody calls that sign, I basically just, you know, get some information about the boxes, you know, the condition of the box, expiration date, uh, what brand do they, do they have. This is important because, you know, when you're invoicing, you got to have the information, you know, for the wholesale to see. Okay, so you figure out what they got, and then from there, you can decide what you want to pay for it. Exactly. Okay, cool. So um, my invoice is, you know, that dated back in January. That's the date, the 24th. Okay, let's see what you got here. So, got the 24th, and you got the 28th. So, in basically four days, if I'm reading this correctly, this is for 472 and 774. So, basically, in four days, you made around 1300 profit. Yep. In four days, man. So, that's, that's how easy the business is, man. You know, you just... Put in the work, take so you, the action, so you get the results. So you basically market? So yeah, you basically just market, you know, you um, get the boxes, the invoice, and you get paid. That's it. That's simple. All right, just to verify this is a real business and these are real invoices, I want to show you that this is his email. And then right here, it shows you the private buyer he uses. So as you can see, medical all right so when you get a client someone calls what do you actually what's the goal are you just trying to buy from them once or are you trying to buy from them multiple times and what's your strategy to that so basically the goal is to retain a client you know you want the client to come back to you month after month so basically when i get a client that calls me i basically have them save their contact information on my phone so that way when they get when they get um prescribed more test trips they'll call my phone number and you know i'll pick them up and go from there you know that's basically the goal you want to basically get that residual income coming in every single month so that way, you know, this business can really take off. So you basically just buy from them one month and they might get product like in another month or another two months, but it's about just trying to get as many clients to sell to you every single month, basically. That's the, that's the main goal. So once you got, you know, X amount of clients, you know, you're making, you know, I mean, you just made $1,400 in four days. So you must have a handful of clients that are selling to you on a repeat basis, no? Absolutely. Okay, cool. All right, so what we got going on here? So basically, this is my client list on my phone. These are the um, clients I have. I actually have, um, you know, some of them without their names, but that's just how many contacts I've been getting, you know, throughout the months I've been doing this business, so. So basically, they just either, they if you buy from them, you basically save their number. Exactly. And, uh, you basically, what, how, how if you if you were to buy from somebody today, how, how when would you call them again? So basically, you know, you want to um, always follow up with people, you know, especially, you know, after, you know, it's been a few weeks after you, you bought a box from you too. So you want to, that's, that's key, man, is follow up. I know you got the little cash flow going. I know you got your credit rocking and now you, what you're actually going to do, like we're going to buy some properties together or what, where are you going with that, with that, uh, with that avenue? So we're basically going to, I'm going to leverage my credit, you know, like I said, buy real estate. Um, we're going to, you know, uh, basically, you know, use it to get funding, you know, to, um, throw into, you know, other businesses to, um, you know, to grow and you know and get paid for man okay cool we're gonna show them your credit report and then we're gonna wrap this video up i appreciate you uh you know j jumping on the channel i Go appreciate down. you you know finding me months ago and then you know it's crazy to watch you take action and really just see massive success with this so we're Go gonna down. check I isaiah's credit report now and um we'll go from there cash flow credit collateral he built the cash flow he got his credit right and now he's about to actually leverage that credit while he has the cash flow pumping and buy collateral, aka real estate. I'm about to show you guys his credit right now and show you guys the proof in the pudding. So as you can see, focus camera. Hold up, let's see. 719. Seven nineteen doesn't get much better than that. All right, Isaiah, thanks for joining the channel, and we'll see you in the next video. No doubt, man.